Hey guys, um, for today's video, we're actually gonna take you around the shop and show you everything that we have set up. Now it's not fully to, you know, what we want. We don't have every tool we ever will need, but we wanna show you just, you know, where everything happens, how everything happens, you know, different places that things are set up. This over here is our original workshop bench. Um, this, we have one of our pieces just hanging that just holds different um, like tapes, things like that, small stuff that we don't need constantly that can still be on the workshop and use, but just not fully all the time. We have a little pegboard wall that's got all our tools on it that we use mostly like our screwdrivers, different hammers, um, rulers, the lighters we use mostly for the epoxy, getting bubbles and stuff like that out, so we use those quite a bit. Um, we got our scissors, pliers, different things like that. This little table I built, um, it's on hinges, so we just take that bottom piece out and set it down and this drops down so it gets out of the way, but we use this when we're doing different um, polyurethanes or working with some of the epoxy, sometimes we'll set it on here. So this can get ripped up instead of this because we wanna preserve that more than this. this can be replaced at any time if we need it to. We have um, different drawers in each drawer. These have stencils, this drawer has paint, that has other um, smaller wooden pieces that we keep with it. Uh, we try to keep this clear but we like to display stuff on it because we have our shelf that has all of our custom orders and things like that in it. And this we just recently added because we started getting in um, cards from other people and like different orders that we make people send us in cards thank you notes, different things like that. And then down in here, we have um, all this stuff in here. This drawer broke out, so we just use this as a shelf, and all this has our packing and shipping stuff for those boxes like I was talking about earlier. This table's got a lot going on. It has our projector that we made and we showed you in our very first video. That's our projector. We just mounted these shelving units. This shelving unit has a lot of the bits that were used in our drill press that we got. And I just built this little shelf here. And this holds our Dremel because our Dremel has an extendable bit on it. So this hangs down and it allows you to go around and you know route out whatever you need to do, Dremel, everything but I made a piece to where you can hang it so it's out of the way whenever we're done using it. And this is easier to be held up because if it's laying on the ground, it can get hot and you just want to have it be able to like circulate the air and just not overheat. So it sits up there, it's out of the way and it's um, a lot better for the actual machine itself when we're using it. But working this way, this is our scroll saw. It's a um, polar cable 16 inch, no, no, no. I think it's the 18, 18 inch scroll saw. These two, and um, I was garage sailing, and this guy got two new saws. He got, you know, his table saw, and the other, he got them, he got brand new ones. So I'm like, okay. I see these outside, I walk up, I'm like, oh yeah, how much is some for? She's like, $20. I'm like, oh, okay, you know, 20 each. And she's like, no, 20 for both. We just want to get rid of them. My husband got new ones. And I was like a kid. I'm like, oh my gosh. I ran to my car. I was like, yep, okay. Took them home. Um, we set this up. This still needs to get mounted to our um, little workbench here. But other than that, uh, we use them. They're really, really handy. I love them. They're in great condition for especially the price that we got them for. But that's our shop um, for our woodworking. We're going to take it over to our video editing shop and show you that. <laughs> 